Hi and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to look at the MacBook Pro from 2009. This MacBook is a model with a 17 inch display and I think that this is the biggest model display model you can buy at the moment uh, if you want the biggest MacBook. Um, I believe the biggest display laptop MacBook you can buy at the moment is 16 inches um, and this model is 17 inches. The machine has a dual core processor and this model has a an 8 gigabyte configuration of RAM. Um, when I bought it, it had a, um, a hard drive built in and I have changed it to an SSD drive. As you can see here, we have the MagSafe charger. Next to it, a an Ethernet port. Uh, here, I believe it is a Firewire port. And we have three USB ports. And here we have a display port and some audio jacks and here is a card reader yes if we go and take a look at the front here we have a micro SD card reader on the right side we have a disk drive I have removed this uh, disk drive in order to make the machine a bit more light. Um, also because, yeah, I don't use uh, CDs any anymore, so I just removed it. Um, I believe you can you can remove the disk drive and instead insert a caddy for um, an SSD or a hard drive if you like. And this is how it looks on the back. This is in a pretty okay condition. And I have installed Linux Mint at the moment. And let's see if how fast Linux Mint boots up. I will start it now. Keep in mind, if you want to buy one of these mo models from 2009 or maybe later, you might want to consider uh, asking the seller if he or she have uh, repasted the CPU because this model will get a bit loud uh, when being under a load. Um, otherwise, you probably want to make a thermal paste replacement yourself. Okay, so now we have booted up to Linux Mint. And yeah, this is how it looks. It's a full HD display, um, 17 inches. Uh, 
let's see what we can find here the task manager so yeah I believe the this machine will probably suit you well if you if you want a machine on the go that is well it's not super light but what it can do is provide you with a pretty nice screen and uh, full HD resolution um, and it's a machine that you would be able to do some light browsing and some uh, light office tasks um, surfing the web uh, all those kind of um, yeah basically any light task but don't expect um, any extreme uh, fast performance uh, being able to play games or being able to uh, video edit or anything that requires um, fast calculations but um, yeah, other than that, it's a pretty nice machine. Um, yeah, I believe that was it for this video. Thank you for watching.